the birds this morning. I thought I was dreaming. Isn't that nice? Beer's made enough food for 12. Oh, yeah, she is amazing. This is the best part about living here, Oops. food. Look at this. We got eggs here. We got sausages. <laughs> she makes almost this much when it's, when it's just me. Yeah. Oh, and it all looks wonderful. Uh, listen, I was thinking about taking the day off and uh, helping Elena get settled in here. Retiring so young. No, I'm not retiring. I think I'm celebrating. I had a very good night last night. I signed the Packard deal. Alan, Michael, did you really? Yes, I did. I got the contract right here. How in the world did you do it? Mm. The food is delicious. I have to tell Vera. She loves compliments. So, Alan Michael, why don't you tell us the secret weapon you have for the Packard deal, eh? Well, if I tell you, then it's not going to be secret. <laughs> no, but I want to know more about your business. Oh, honey. Perhaps it's best if you don't ask too many questions. Um, listen, Eleni, you'll, you'll find out everything soon enough, sweetheart. <laughs> In the meantime, I don't want to talk about business, you know. While we're having a meal. Neither do I, except to say how proud I am of you. The Packard account. Oh. We'll have record quarterly earnings. Mm -hmm. We should put Billy Lewis in his place. It's a nice fringe benefit, isn't it? No more than he deserves. As long as it was legal. Well, nobody died. <laughs> oh, Michael, you're so funny. This is the most honest man I know. Now I want to change the subject, okay? I want to devote this entire day to my wife. I want to show her the grounds, the layout. I want you to really get used to being here. Well, you deserve it. In fact, let's have a little party tonight. Sort of a, a welcome home victory celebration. Just family and a few friends. Oh, that sounds nice. You see, I knew this would pick up your spirits once we moved in here. It will be nice to have a house full of people. Yes. Show off my brilliant nephew and his beautiful wife. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Eleni, do wear the Reinhold ruby tonight. Oh, I, you know, I wanted to talk to you. You know, we don't have to talk about what to wear now. I mean, besides, everybody's too busy devouring food in this house to uh, notice. He's right. Vera will be very happy. She gets depressed when her kitchen doesn't get a full workout. <laughs> I'll go tell her. Oh, she made that sesame cake you like so much. Oh, good. Well, I wouldn't give to see the look on Billy Lewis's face this morning. <laughs> that you've been so helpful lately. I wondered what you were getting out of betraying your father, but it's all clear now. Alexander, I'm just doing my job. No. You still think you can get Alan Michael, don't you? Oh, Alexandra, you're way off track here. I don't think so. It's just want and want and want with you, isn't it? Well, let me remind you, Alan Michael is a happily married man. Very happily married. So don't touch. It's not just me, Alexandra. I would never go after a man who didn't want me. A very stupid thing. I I lost the ring. Oh, I'm so sorry. We looked everywhere and I could not find it. I felt so bad. And Alan Michael, he just did this, you know, to protect me. From telling me? Well, he just wanted to help. He was being thoughtful. Yeah. Why go to all the trouble of trying to fool me? The ring was insured. We'll recover its full value. Yes, but it meant so much to your family. I... Well, it, it was a very distinctive piece. Someone may find it and return it. Oh, I, I hope so. I would love for that to happen. You should have told me right from the start. I know. I'm sorry. It's... Well, it's just sometimes people, they get so nervous around you. People who are honest have nothing to fear from me. Oh, what a charming piece. Was this in your family? I know. Well, I bet Alan Michael didn't give you this. Where did you get it? Hello? Eleni? Yes, yes, I'm here. Honey, I'm sorry Blake came barging in here. Oh, 
That, that's okay. She's, she's gone now anyway. Huh? Curious. How do you feel about her working with your husband? Well, uh, if Alan Michael wanted to remarry Blake, there was nothing stopping him. But he did not. I suppose he must know why he didn't, huh? Wouldn't Blake be surprised that someone as innocent as you knows more about men than she does? <laughs> oh, the Reinhold Ruby. Well, what's it doing in this store box? Ah, uh, you know, I just didn't know where to put it. <laughs> so I put it in the... This is not the Ruby. It's a very good copy. Oh, maybe... Ah, uh, uh, yes. Yes, it, it is. But why? 